when I was learning Ois Nun in Savasri Vash, which says, don't gaze at the face of a person whose thoughts are not connected to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, because it could blemish the soul. And a person should, a person can look at somebody and gaze at somebody who is attached to HaKadosh Baruch Hu. So I learned this piece, Nun, and um, <laughs> for when davening, I was staring at Rabbi Singer. <laughs> he was dappling us, staring at Rabbi Singer. And uh, he looked at me and he winked at me, like looked at me because he noticed I was staring at him. And a couple of days ago, I was with um, my dear friend, Mordechai, and we went to Rabbi, uh, oh, no, no, sorry, he was on Shabbos. It was on Shabbos, Mordechai, some of you have met. He was davening by Rabbi Greenblatt. And while Rabbi Greenblatt was saying Shema, Mordechai was looking at him, and <laughs> Rabbi, Rabbi Greenbaum opened up his fingers as he was saying, Shema, and looked at Mordechai looking at him. Ay, Baruch Hashem. But the takeaway I want to say here is that while we're davening, while we're davening, it's good to look at people davening, get, get inspiration. When we're davening with our friends, when we are davening with our friends, look at our friends davening. Get a chiyas. Often, when I'm davening and and uh, I'm I'm losing a little, I just look at somebody, look at that davening. I'll, I'll just look at his eyes. I'll burn the shalom. Look at that. Wow. It may not inspire me to daven any more, but I have just a karasatov. Thank you, Hakadosh Baruch Hu. Look at these beautiful people around me, davening and connecting to Hakadosh Baruch Hu. So I remember this Baal Shem Tov Nun. Just look at other people davening and be happy. Be happy that this exists. Be happy that people can connect like this. Beautiful. Maybe it will inspire you more. Maybe it won't. But I'm happy just to look at somebody, but Wow.